evening. Uh, yes, it is a wonderful evening. Wonderful evening here in Wales. There is the, the moon. I don't know if you can see the moon up there in the sky. It's cold, it's fresh. It's quite nice actually. Birds are tweeting. There's a couple of clouds in the sky. A couple of them have gone a bit red there. There you go. It's quite a nice evening. There's the Christmas tree in the village all lit up, bright and sparkly. And it's a wonderful Christmas feeling in the air. I don't know if you, you get that. I don't know if you feel that vibe. The run up to Christmas can be quite static in the air. You, you, could, you, you can taste Christmas. You can taste the, the chicken and the roast potatoes and, and the, the mulled wine and oh, Christmas pudding and custard. Quality Street. Oh man. Fruit jellies. <laughs> so I went out on the weekend and we went to Winter Wonderland in Cardiff and it was a fantastic time. And what I'm talking about here is, uh, is diet. <laughs> Don't diet over Christmas, it's not worth it. It's not. Just enjoy life. I've had a roast turkey dinner. I've had Christmas pudding. I've had another roast turkey dinner. I've had a big chocolate sundae. I had hot dogs, candy floss, um, donuts. I've had chocolates, crisps, coffees. I have been a little piggy over the last couple of days. <laughs> being a little piggy and you might be thinking wow wow I thought you were on a diet Clive no I'm not on a diet I'm on maintenance and it doesn't really matter anyway I'm just living life now because I've got to the point where I'm happy and and per, on a personal goal um, I just want to just maintain what I've got so if I means I can go out and have a really good blast on a weekend and enjoy my Christmas food and parties and stuff and then work a little bit harder during the week to, to burn some of that off and then that's what I'm going to do it's uh, it's pretty good and the other thing I've, I've noticed that I'm, I've seen a couple of posts on you that you know people say well I've done really well this week and uh, but I another one another one said but I put a half a pound on half a pound pound it's neither here or there really it, it could be the fact that you're holding a little bit of water or what I've noticed with my wife Jane is her digestive system is a lot slower than mine. I, my, my digestive system um, is a lot faster. I noticed that my, my, my metabolic rate then is higher. And uh, oh, there's a football there now and Bonnie's going to be barking. She wants to play football. So um, my metabolic rate is quite high. So. If I have some food, like I was weighing, I was weighing three pound heavier yesterday uh, after all our food I had. And I got on the scales this morning and I've dropped two pound already. And I don't know where that two pound went. I'm telling you, no, I had a lot of food. I had a lot of food. Where's that two pound gone? Well, it's obviously passed through my system and um, and I'm, I'm, I'm gone down the toilet, basically. It must be. It's the only place it can be. So, um, and, and Jane again, 10 stone three, 10 stone three, 10 stone three. Oh God, she said, I put on a couple of pound. I knew I shouldn't have done so and so. I said, don't ever beat yourself up. And she got on the weighing scales this morning. She's lost two pounds. Where did that go? There you go. So obviously that Jane's diet um, metabolic rate is slightly slower than mine. And the fact that uh, she digests food a lot slower. Come here, Molly. She digests food a lot slower. <laughs> Trying to negotiate my dog and talk at the same time. It doesn't really work. Um, her med med metabolic rate is obviously slower and her digestive system is slower. So she's going to hold um, food and water in her, in her guts. And uh, that's something you've got to be aware of when you're on these diets. Or as I like to say it, you know, healthy living, start healthy living and lifestyle. I don't diet. I just eat it healthily and that's the thing. We oui. <laughs> Go out and enjoy yourselves. Have a bit of fun. Eat what you want to eat. 
yes we're going to pay the price at the end of it and yes some of that is going to turn into fat but you know this time of the year is not meant it's meant to be enjoyed and that's what about i just it's about living life and enjoying life i've said this so many times don't get hung up on certain things then we've got the rest of the year to put it right so if i go and put on half a stone over christmas i've got i've got another 11 months to to work it off and as long as we do that as long as we get back on our plans and get back on our schedules and get back on our our um healthy diets then we've got nothing to fear except fear itself and that's the most important thing is just enjoy life and at this moment in time it's exactly what i am doing enjoying life okay let's cross this road and i'll talk to you tomorrow